Dr. Kevin Endy discussing follicular unit hair transplantation and hairline lowering. One thing I did want to discuss about these newsletters and all the pictures that you see on my website is that these patients have given full permission uh, for me to show their pictures of hairline lowerings and follicular unit hair transplants. Now, of course, some patients are very proud of their results and uh, they want to display them to the world and show their full face. Other patients give me permission by just showing the areas that we actually transplanted, whether it's the sideburns or the, the top of the head or the hairline or whatever it may be. Um, but it's great that I'm able to show my audience and my prospective patients so many before and after pictures of procedures I've done. Some people ask me, well, why don't you have hundreds or thousands of hair transplant pictures if you've done so many thousands of surgeries on the hair and on the face? Well, the simple answer is that not everybody wants their pictures to be shown. Uh, certainly, if you have a procedure with me, I'd be more than happy to display your pictures before and after, and you can always go on a website and view them and maybe even be part of one of my upcoming newsletters. But certainly, that is not a requirement to have surgery with me, and I certainly respect patient privacy, would never show any pictures without full written signed permission um, to do this. And, uh, you know, again, your, your privacy is of utmost importance to me. And I certainly would not uh, to go behind your back and, and display pictures without your full permission.